I'm making this video on back to school. Uh, many people are going to be sending their kids back to school here pretty soon. And the big thing you're going to start hearing with this back to school deal is lice. It happened last year and it's been going around for a while. Uh, there's this new thing called mutant lice that's not dying and, and responding to the typical treatments that they've normally used for lice. And so here's the answer. I made a video about this before, but I'm going to tell you again. The answer is essential oils. And I'm going to show you from the government's own website the fact that these things will treat all lice. So if you're sending your kids back to school, do yourself a favor. Get some lavender essential oil. Get some tea tree essential oil. Both of these things have been proven to kill lice and their eggs within 24 hours. You can make a combination of them. I sell these blue cobalt bottles. You can get your own bottle, get your own spray bottle. It doesn't matter. It, one, one or two ounces, whatever you want. These ones that I have are one ounce. You fill it up almost to the top. Leave enough space so you can put some drops of the essential oils in there with the uh, lavender and tea tree oil. Uh, 10 to 15 drops of each should be more than sufficient. Your kids are going to school every day. You take that bottle, shake it up. There you go. You spray it around their head, spray it around their clothes. Whammo. Guess what? You will never have a problem with lice with your children ever. If you do that every single day, you don't even have to do it every day if you're concerned about lice. And even if they got lice, you can use that stuff. And you could take the essential oils and you can put it in their shampoo and you can scrub their hair with it. You're not going to need to use this toxic over-the-counter garbage that's, that's not going to work. Okay, so let me just point out some of the different uh, websites and studies. Here's one. This is from the USNIH, the potential effectiveness of essential oils as a treatment for head lice. Uh, abstract, essential oils of aniseed, cinnamon leaf, red thyme, tea tree, peppermint, nutmeg, rosemary, and pine tree were tested in vitro against lice. <clears throat> All the oils except for rosemary and pine were found to be effective in the laboratory when applied in an alcohol solution and followed by a rinse the following morning in an essential oil vinegar water mixture. Peppermint and nutmeg were only used as a blend rather than as individual oils. Okay, here's some other stuff I'm going to show you. There's another story. Activity of tea tree oil and nerolidol alone or in combination against head lice and its eggs. Let me pull. The in vitro effect of natural substances at different concentrations were evaluated against 69 head lice, adults and nymphs, and 187 louse eggs collected from school children in central Italy. Here's what you need to see. Tea tree oil was more effective against head lice with 100% mortality at 30 minutes and 1% concentration. Got that? 100% mortality with tea tree oil. Why are people going out and buying all this over-the-counter junk? There's more. This story, let's see here. Uh, how to kill super lice with essential oils. This is from a blog, Healthy by Nature, hwc.com. Um, anyway, in here, they talk about lavender and tea tree oil, but uh, this one says, another study completed in 2010 compared the efficacy of tea tree oil and lavender oil against these two chemicals that they're using in all these over-the-counter uh, head lice treatments. And it says, uh, impressively, 41 of 42, or 97.6% of the tea tree oil, lavender oil treatment group were louse-free one day after the final application, whereas only 10 of 40, or 25% from the chemical insecticide group were free from lice after the last treatment. So that's astounding. So... If you're concerned about sending your kids back to school, this is a this is a no-brainer. Get yourself some tea tree oil. Get yourself some lavender. Put it in their shampoo. All you gotta do is sh uh, scrub their head up with some shampoo. Put ten or so drops on their hair directly. Scrub it in there with the shampoo, and uh, don't even worry about it. And then you can do the other treatment that I showed you, where you can put it in the spray bottle and spray that stuff on their head. Uh, believe me, you're gonna start hearing about this again now that all these kids go back to school. And this is going to keep you and your family safe and free from lice. Guaranteed. And if you're looking for some of the best essential oils on the market, you can go to 7lights.net. 7lights.net. Uh, essential oils. They have over 30 different essential oils. 
They have the cobalt blue bottles that are up there that you can purchase. They also have lavender. They have tea tree oil. They have bug shield, which is another really good one. And anyway, you'll find all that you need from there. And your, your worries are going to be over. Thanks for watching. If you like this video, please uh, subscribe to our YouTube channel. Thank you.